Michigan. Yes, it's only a few hours away from Illinois, so I have been there many times, but I've only gone there for a quick trip. Now, I will be living and working for three months in this beautiful state. There's a lot to experience, including the beautiful weather, the beautiful people, and yes, the bitter, bitter cold winter. But I will not be there during that time. I will only be there for the spring and half of the summer. There's many things to experience. That's including biking, hiking in this beautiful state parks, and also fishing and hunting. Will I be doing those things? Probably not. There is also the city and malls and the beautiful, beautiful bars that I love to drink at. Oh yes, I'm excited. I hope you guys are too. Let's enjoy Michigan. Thank you. I had to get my vanilla iced coffee. It's actually my favorite iced coffee. It's from McDonald's, you know. I just wanted a quick little snack, so this is why I got a McDonald's Happy Meal. I'm on my journey to become happy, so this gonna help me today. Get most guy's little car seat. He's little, so he needs to look out the window too, not just me. This is team effort, you know, we're both traveling together. This journey is not just for me, it's for him. If you missed my last vlog, you can click right onto that. I gave you three clues about the state I'm heading to. I'm gonna spend three months there. I'm gonna stop halfway and get a hotel before I actually end up at my Airbnb. I'm getting into Indiana right now. Just passing through. Welcome to Michigan. Thank you! to start acting up it's okay it's his day oh it's a big star come here i'm gonna try this one out try it do you want it or not yeah yeah you do oh good boy you like it huh you get to have it because it's your birthday it's your birthday what kind of toy you want gizmo all right let's see do you want a cow I'm not feeling this one. You like the cow, really? Really? That's what you want? <laughs> okay, one more toy. One more toy, which one you want? You want this one? You want that one? Yep. Okay, I think that's your second toy. <laughs> okay, 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 let go. Okay. <laughs> Gizmo. Come on, we gotta go, we gotta go. <laughs> oh my God, dog. Excuse me? Is your bakery closed? So it isn't like a walk-in bakery. We they make cookies and then they just put it up front. Oh. Store. We don't do like. Uh, oh okay. Cake. So there's some up there then. Yeah. Oh okay. All right. Great. Thank you. Oh. Blue one. 
get you a pink one. Total $63.52. Okay. What can I do for you? I have reservations. Okay. Now, is she a service dog? Yes. Well, she's not a service dog. She's an ES ESA dog. What's the ESA. I don't know what that is. Well, they're both for medical reasons. Okay. Because um, it's for a pet, it's not five dollars. Right. Not a problem. He's not a pet. He's a dog. He's a he's a ESA well, it dog. Dog, cat, fish, hamsters. No, no, no. I don't think you understand. But he, he's he's not a pet. He is an ESA dog. Okay. Just like a service dog, they're not considered pets neither. Okay, I've never heard of that, but that's fine. I, I won't charge you. You've but never heard? That's something that you should know. I, I know about service dogs, yes. It's, it's pretty much the same thing. The only difference is service dogs, they're allowed everywhere. Um, ESA dogs are protected under the Housing Act. Okay, I didn't realize that. Yeah, but, the, Sorry, but they're not, I, I no, it's fine. Me. They're not allowed in like grocery stores, like service dogs, stuff like that. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, no, I'm surprised they haven't told you about that. What was that code you told me? I'm sorry, I don't know. This? The, the code for the dog, so I have to tell my boss about The code? Sure. Oh, E-S-A. E-S-A. Yeah, dog, yeah. And it, so it, it, that means emotional support animal. Okay, mm -hmm. sorry. I wasn't trying to offend you. Just, no, I'm, I'm just... Well, it, I've heard of that. This has been a problem a lot with a I, lot of I've hotels. Heard that, yeah. but I didn't know they... I thought service dog was over, they covered all of that. No, it's th they're two different things. It's, it's, there's a mix of the same stuff, but service dogs are have more leeway. So with this, my boss said, "Why did you charge seventy five dollars?" I said, "Well, she, it's a yes, an a dog." All right. So. All right. All right. That's it. You are set. Okay. Is there anything else I can do for you? Uh, that's it. Let me get my water. I am here until 11 o'clock tonight. Are you hating? Let us know. Okay. I hope you enjoy. Thank you so much. You have a good day. You. Bye bye. Good boy. <laughs> it's your birthday. It's your birthday. At home, you're not allowed to go on the bed. But here, you're allowed to. Come on, Dougie. Come on. It's your birthday. This is gonna be our stay for one night. Got the kitchen, this is the sink. Y'all can see. That's what we got going on here. And this is the bathroom. Yeah, I don't know what's in here, it's a blow dryer. So yeah, pretty much it, guys. Hi. Couch, TV, desk. I have not eaten all day. But my mama packed me some food. She packed me a Gatorade too. I'm gonna I'm drink that in a bit. And you know I'm Mexican when my mama wraps the food with this, okay? What she make me here? She made me lots of, I think it's burritos or something. I don't know, but I'm gonna eat this. I'll probably eat two, fuck it. I hope everybody's having a great day. Before I left my house, I walked around in every room and I did not expect to react the way that I did. I walked around talking to God and I teared up. I was basically thanking him for blessing me with that house. I worked really hard for it. Everything that's in it, I worked really hard for. It was a goal that I accomplished. And I thanked God for giving me that blessing because without him, it doesn't matter how, how much work I put in. He sees my good heart and he knows that I deserve th that I deserve certain things in life, and that was one of them. And I guess I teared up because I'm gonna miss it. I'm gonna miss that house. I didn't think I was gonna miss it like that, but but you know, life moves on, and I gotta keep moving forward. My baby is three years old today, and we're gonna celebrate with him. I am pretty much a private contractor, so I can work with any agency with the work that I do. Right now, I'm working with one agency with my first assignment. I'm gonna book a room that I found on Airbnb. So this is gonna be my first time living with a stranger that I do not know. But the good thing is that she has a dog. So Gizmo's already gonna have a friend. So you're already ahead of the game, Gizmo. It's gonna be harder for me to find one. <laughs> it's only been one day and I've already had the feeling of nerves, fear, sadness, and excitement all in one day and the day's not even over yet and i'm already coming out of my comfort zone living in a house with a stranger and there's rules in the house so <laughs> coming from a house that i own made my own rules 
it's gonna be a little different for sure. I got um two happy birthday cookies, blue and pink. He can decide which one he wants, not my decision. Which one you want? You like the pink one. There you go. And no faucet water for my baby today. You get to have water from the bottle. Oh yeah. So this here is a ESA vest. He doesn't have to wear this, but to let the transition happen where everywhere you go so you don't have to get questioned all the time. Once they see this vest, they understand what he is. And there are still some places that are not informed with ESA dogs, as y'all already saw at the front desk. I can pick him up like this <laughs> in a safe way. It's got a handle. It, it lifts him from here and from here. He doesn't get choked or anything like that. But I don't need to do all that. He's a small dog, you just pick him up normally. This dog supports me emotionally. He is considered medication for people who are who are suffering from like mental illnesses like depression, anxiety. And it can be any type of animal. It doesn't have to be a dog. It can be a snake. It can be a bunny. But your psychiatrist or, or a therapist has to prescribe you. That's the only way you can get your animal to be an emotional support animal. When it comes to my situation, having depression, I feel alone a lot. So having him gives me some form of stability. I talk to him, <laughs> he's my best friend, he hangs out with me, he doesn't judge me. <laughs> He just loves me. He's just here to love me and I'm here to love him back because he's my baby boy. That's what an ESA is. It's been a long day. I'm going to drink this coffee and hopefully stay up a little bit longer because I have some videos to edit and I really want you guys to watch them. So let me get to work. All right, you guys. In the next vlog, you're going to see where I'll be staying at and I don't know, whatever pops up. Make sure you like comment, share, and subscribe, and please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next video. Peace.